are listening to you're listening to you are listening to you're listening to Kenny you're listening you're listening to active fm 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 welcome welcome to the sporting base where radio has never been better Sha. No, guys. No. <laughs> what the heck? What the? Guys, you're complaining that we have a lot. Wait. Of aren't we all WhatsApping Why together? No. We'll no all that's because everyone's ourselves. got different ideas. We'll all introduce ourselves and then we so can serve. Yes. Okay. Hey, DJ, must restart. She doesn't start. I'm interrupting. Yeah, I'm going. Go I've right. got my idea already. Thank you. Okay. okay. Three, two, one. What's up? This is Nalzi Lee from The Best Show on Active FM. Two of the best shows on Active FM, Philosophically Poetic and Decoding the Crime Verse. What's up? This is Ashley from The Table of Perspective, the top show of Active FM. And this is Tabo uh, from, first of all, the best football show <laughs> on Active FM, uh, because we are not the only one, there are more. <coughs> and I'm from The Shade as well, which is also one of the best. <laughs> 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 Hi, I'm Sash. <laughs> I am from the movie show, the only movie show on Active FM. And I'm also from The Shade, the only shadiest show on Active FM. So I'm one of Yay. a kind. Hi, my name is Ryan from Active Worship. <laughs> All right. And you're listening to Active FM, Active FM, Active FM. <laughs> and this is the housemaster from the housemaster show. <laughs> <laughs> wow. There's actually something we all have in common here, other than the fact that we're all on Active FM. We we'll all attend the Active Church. <laughs> and, and we're all involved in a film production company called Active, Active. TV. Oh. I mm. thought you were going to say we're all wearing black. Hi. And that. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So what we're going to do today is we make original films. And we have just finished our last original film, so we need an, a new idea. We yeah. need a new concept. Yes. So we are going to have a pitch meeting for what is our next film going to be about. And Definitely. And you're allowed to comment below if you have any ideas. Definitely. And give us a vote. So if someone gives a, you know, a, a an idea, then just say, yeah, 10 out of 10. No, 9 out of 10. No, 1 out of 10. One. Negative 0 out of 10. All right, people, so let's start this off. What genre are we going for? Okay, I suppose we're starting with genres then, eh? Sci-fi. Oh, no, sci-fi is cool. Let's do horror. What? Horror. <laughs> it's in scary <laughs> stuff, you know what I'm saying? We've done horror before. No, we haven't. Uh, Not a real horror. Okay, I suppose, <laughs> I suppose it, it wasn't an original idea, but it was we stole someone else's script. No, I say sci-fi. Science fiction. I don't vote sci-fi because sci-fi is difficult to do on all levels. No, it's not. It is. We, ha we have the, the abilities to do VFX and all these sci-fi stuff. Like, if you do not go above your abilities, then how are you going to do it? You do something you're good at. No, but you need to do something you're not good at to be good at it. Okay, let's take a vote. Everyone say what genre you want. So we've got horror, we've got sci-fi. I vote we do a rom-com. Oh! <laughs> That's cool. What? I vote comedy. You know, rom-com has, has the comedy. word comedy in How it. How dare you? Romance, romance comedy. Rom-com. Romance comedy. You know, I actually also vote a rom-com. I'm just, I'm just going for a rom-com. <coughs> You've done it before. <laughs> I um I have to vote an action movie. Oh, who's with me? Action. Ryan, but haven't you yeah. done action movies already? Like Jack Leaper was like kind of like an action movie. The Expendables was an action movie. We've already done a lot of action movies. Sorry, what's your point? <laughs> that we cannot do an action movie. It's not why because we've already done it. So the point of this is something we've not done before. What if we mix a romantic... Co no, that's we, that's been done before. I was going to say a romance and an action film. But the girl dies in the end, right? Yeah. Action yes. films <laughs> suck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so we have not decided on a genre. Yeah. Sci-fi is the... Sci-fi is out and horror is out. No, it's there is no double out. vote. Okay, let's do a vote. So, Romcon, put your hands up. We have uh, Nolene and Ash and... Uh, Sash. 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 Not Ash, Sash. Anyone else want to join the rom-com no. train? No. 
Sci-Fi no. is not out. It's got comedy in it. No. <laughs> so two out of six. Okay. All right. And who votes? Who votes comedy? Okay. Don't don't need a mic for that. Okay. There you go. So comedy rules. All right. Let's move on. Okay. So main character. What is his problem? What? So he's a midget. <laughs> <laughs> so the problem is he's short. <laughs> And Glory, the guy that's recording here, which is very tall, is laughing. So <laughs> that is actually a big problem. I think I'm going to go with that one. Okay, <laughs> so we have a short dude. Is his main problem in life so that he's short? It's a comedy, and his problem oh is that God. he's short. Okay, what's his name? And he's trying to be tall. No, why would you try to be tall yeah, when you're short? No, no. Exactly. You know, there are other people that wa- that are short that want to be tall. You know what I'm saying? Want to be tall. Yeah, but they can't <laughs> be tall. So that's like that's like just now we now we're going into like a psychiatric drama. Like yeah, that is tall the people point. Want to be short. <laughs> I don't agree with that. I don't Short's think tall people. Yeah. yeah, and I don't think all to- uh, short people want to be tall. Um, eighty oh, percent. Yeah, that there's tall. still twenty percent that <laughs> don't though. Okay, so okay, that's not gonna work. Okay, what fine. is his What is his end goal? And what is the character arc? So we have a short person. By the end of the film, does he accept the fact that he's short? Does he come to terms with the fact that That he's short? That is boring. Do we realize that he was a 13-year-old that hadn't gone through a growth spurt and that he just needed to wait two years and then suddenly, like, what are we dealing with here? Hi, Tabo, take back your your, your thing because now... No, 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 people, we are creative people here. We have a storyline here. Let's add some stuff to it and see what we end up with. Who knows? Maybe we might be might sell our scripts to a big company. We are the big company. <coughs> <coughs> exactly. But we don't buy scripts. A big company that buy scripts. You know what I mean? <coughs> Maybe that's his problem. <laughs> <laughs> okay, short person that wants to be no. What is his problem? He wants to be tall, or his problem is just yes, that he's short, he so he can't. Yes, he wants to be tall. No, is his problem Beca- that he's short, so he just can't reach things? You know, like maybe that's, that's the problem. That's why he wants if to it's be a tall. Guy, um, his girlfriend is taller than him, and I mean like very tall. Now we went into rom com. That's rom com right there. No. Yes. Yes. There's it is. a rom com okay, called Tall Girl. <laughs> yeah. Really? Okay, mm-hmm. I didn't I know, know that. Know that so. What Good if, movie. what if, I've got an idea, people. Yeah. We have a short dude, right? His grandmother dies and <laughs> she secretly didn't like him. So she left a <laughs> million dollars at the top part or the highest, like <laughs> somewhere that he can't <laughs> reach. <laughs> and he knows that it's there and she even told him that it's there. And she like dies with a smile on her face. <laughs> <laughs> and the whole film is about him trying to get this money. Does he not have like letters and chairs? Maybe it's like like that tall like it's in a spot that he just like even if he climbs the ladder it's maybe that's the whole film is him trying to get to the money and like everything's just i feel like even a tall guy would have that problem though no 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 look what you guys are forgetting here (laughs) is that this this movie is set in the 1200s (laughs) so there are no ladders yet Wait, wow. if there are no I letters like yet, the how? The, I actually like where this is going. We, we've gone from modern to, to, to back to in much the day. Earlier. This is great. What if this is a guy that invents the letter? Oh! oh! Nice! nice! Cool! Nice! Okay, guys, Very nice! We're seriously talking about our next film here. Why for real, eh? I hope not. Okay, so a short <laughs> dude that wants his money. And already we have his surname, Ladder, right? Because everyone who invents things, yeah, true, they make yeah. it this. Okay, cool. Can we call him George? George Ladder. George Ladder. Boom! What if we get to the end of the film and the money's not there? Like plot twist. Maybe the grand ch- tricked him by saying that it's up there just for him the to... The grand wanted him to do something with his life, so he wanted him to invent something. So he invents the ladder. At the end of the day, at the end of the movie, he gets to the end of the movie and it's like, <coughs> there's a note there and well done, you've done something with your life, he invents it. And he got money by s- selling the idea of a ladder. That is a good idea. All right, there you go. So that was Active FM and this was... <laughs> what show was <laughs> Our pitch meeting, the Active TV pitch meeting. <laughs> so, guys, I, I just feel like we should bring in some romance. No romance? Nothing? No, I guess there should be romance. Uh, he meets a girl along the, the way. Like there is, and then she's like, no. Mm. That's it. Because you were short or yeah. what? Shame. Short of P- cash. P- yes. Oh! oh! So he's like, it's because I'm short, isn't it? She's, She's like, like, no. 
It's because you're short on cash. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the Drop away. the phone. <laughs> and then the last scene, she sees him. And then she sees him on top of the ladder. <laughs> and now he's famous now. So it's like, oh, now you want to come. Now you look up to me. So technically it's like... <gasps> and the film's called Look Up. Yes. Okay. Done that people. has been Active FM. Thank you very much for yeah. listening Active and watching. TV. Active TV has Pitch done the meeting. most. Um, yeah. Yeah. Guys, we've still got five minutes. Come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Let's okay, go. the sequel. The sequel, people. The yeah. sequel. We are not short of time here. Oh! oh! What if the studio is like short of everything? He's short of time. He's short of cash. He's short of height. Oh, he's he short of love. He's short of health. Oh, he has a health condition. Short of health. Ah, uh, no, that's <laughs> hardcore. And he thinks that cash can solve his health problem. <coughs> but it's actually something else. You see, that's now the third. Mm. Huh. Or maybe we just do like a mini series where every episode is what he's, he's short on. Mm. So the first episode, he's short on money. Second episode, he's short on love. Third episode, he's short on time. And then he dies. End of mini series. <laughs> What happened <laughs> to the him building? Yeah, ladder? I did that in the first one. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and then now. Now, oh okay. now he died because he lost. So, he, what he is the concept of, time. of the time one? Because we have two concepts for the ladder. Uh, he, the told he, he, he was told he had three months to live. <laughs> so, he needed to do something with his life in that short period of time. Technically. Yeah, but then he died. Shame. Maybe he died early. <coughs> you told me I had three months! <laughs> <laughs> I will and then he dies <laughs> Doctor's like, sorry what did, did you get did anyone no and then he wakes up I will <laughs> and his like last words were from Shrek with a dad the frog oh, yeah. was dying yeah. and then he wakes up and like eats the do you remember the, the that the fly he eats like, the fly and then he comes and, <laughs> and then he's dead again shame and it's a rom-com after all so yeah yeah I feel like everyone's traumatized. Yeah. <laughs> Nosey <Nosy. laughs> It's like... I feel like this is one of those movies that uh, you watch for entertainment. It's There's like the Ballad of Buster Scruggs where the whole thing was about death. I suppose that's a comedy, so it does yeah. make sense. So this whole thing is about being short on every area, in every area. And Nadine, then what is you look traumatized. I feel like we've just made death funny, so I don't know what to say at this point. But you're part of a show that makes like... Death, funny. We don't make it funny. You should do. You're like, oh, that's so cool. He killed five people. <laughs> that's cool. cool. It's not funny. I guess how he did <laughs> like it. he's my idol. That's even worse. <laughs> that is even worse. Okay, not idol. Is in like I also want to kill people, but like you know, sometimes people just do like awesome things, and you're like, like who would think of that? You just called someone killing someone an awesome thing. No, it depends on like the type of serial killer, what they did. So there's different types of serial killers. So this man was short on time, eh? No! <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he a serial... He's short... Wait, take take everything back. He's short on time because there's a serial killer in the third episode. Ha-ha! Mm. That should be a cool serial killer, though. Yeah, yeah that's fine. Mm. You can make him whoever you... Who, okay, who is the serial killer? You've got like a minute to tell us. Come up with your best shot. Eddie, his best friend. How does he kill? So it's his best friend that kills him. Yeah. Okay, why? What is the motive? The motive is because he's a serial killer. No, but ha no, but all serial killers have reason to kill, isn't did it? Did something happen in his childhood? Yeah. Did he, also, did he feel too tall? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Eddie was always teased because he was the tallest. So, so the way he, he kills people, people is that he cuts their legs off and lets them bleed to death from <gasps> their knees. <gasps> Maybe the serial killer kills short people. Yeah, that's yeah. how he kills them. He's got something against short people, and then and and our, our what is his name? John. George. 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 George Ladder. George Ladder is his next victim, and so there's threats throughout, and so the whole movie goes about finding exactly who it is. So you actually, oh, now it's a mi comedy mystery. Yeah. Ooh. How many people has uh, Mr. Eddie killed? Only forty-two. Oh. Oh. And his third victim is going to be George. Yeah. Number forty-three. At the age of 43. Does he buy him a shirt? Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Now I see what she means. Mm. He kills them 
like their age. So the f- his first victim, that's freaky. His first victim was one. Yeah. His second victim was two. Yeah. His 13th victim, victim, vic- I don't know what I just said, was 13. <laughs> his 15th victim mm. was? 15. Thir- no, don't. Wait, why? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you'll be his guys. This and what? And what if he does it in alphabetical order? So the person that he killed, the first person he killed uh, was uh, Alfred. <laughs> no, it didn't work because George is George not the forty. That third she is not the forty. <laughs> and so yeah, we we yeah. might just okay, but second to, um, is it forty three? Guys, just uh, script rewrite. So we'll just scribble out. How many letters are there? In the, the, how many? Uh, Twenty six. So it won't work. Twenty six plus seven is. It'll work. Definitely thirty three. Oh man, still have to get to 43. That was close. Mm. Wait. Flip. Plus 14? Plus 40? So. No, that did. 26 plus 14? 26 plus 14? Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Yeah. So twenty-six plus seventeen. Okay, guys, it's fine. No, uh, no alphabetical <laughs> order. <laughs> Just age-wise. There we go. And we are calling it look up. Look up. Look, look up. up. All right, Look cool. Up. Staple the papers together. There we go. Pilot. Mm-hmm. Put it in the cabinet. Active TV original. There you go. Coming to oh, you stamp. soon. <laughs> yeah. This has been the Active FM Live. Yeah. With Active TV. Mm-hmm. And all From of us. us. Peace. And George. <laughs>